What's the worst physical pain you've ever felt? Double tram flap reconstruction after my second mastectomy. My skin lost too much elasticity from the previous radiation on my right side, so I couldn't do implants. The flap reconstruction is kinda Humpty Dumpty surgery, where they kinda take you apart and put you back together again, using your abdominal flesh and or muscles to rebuild yaw some breasts. They did the mastectomy and reconstruction at the same time, took three surgical teams and about 18 hours from start until I woke up in the ICU. I was 32, after having my first mastectomy, chemo, radiation when I was 23 and diagnosed with stage 3 triple negative ductal carcinoma. The reconstruction took about a year to fully heal, this was almost 15 years ago now. I have the breast scars, of course, but the most interesting one is all the way around my middle, with only about 10 inches on my lower back let uncut. A month before this one, I had a hysterectomy, and they went in over that scar like it never happened. They warned me it was going to be harder than I thought. They were right, as hard as I thought it was going to be, and I was ready, all my previous surgeries and treatments had made me pretty good at pain disassociation, the recovery from this was crazy. After a week in the hospital, and about a month post-op, and I still had 6 of 8 drains in, twice daily wet to dry bandage changes over the struggling skin where I'd had radiation a decade before, an emergency surgery for an abdominal post-op infection they misdiagnosed until it almost killed me, spending every day and night in a reclining position because I couldn't stand up straight or lay down flat while everything healed, all the Roxy set, Oxy, Vicodin no longer working, I finally cracked and cried like I've never cried. Maybe I shouldn't have done this one? The pain and exhaustion was overwhelming, and I fully lost my ability to handle it gracefully. It felt so good to cry and let it all go. Just admit human frailty, and admit I was uncertain about my choice to have the reconstruction. I think I started to take a turn for the better after that. A year later I had a couple revision surgeries, then areola tattoos, and another surgery where they kinda origami the tissue into nipple-like things, lol, still had to do wet to dry changes for a good year, and then it took another 5 years or so for it to actually fully scar over completely. It looks like a melty burn the size of my palm, but it's honest, and I love it. I'm 14 years out from all the reconstruction, and 22 years out from my initial diagnosis. I love my scars, I love it all. And I'm so, so glad I did the reconstruction. It really was worth IT.